This week, the Honolulu City Council will introduce a new measure aimed at imposing penalties to anyone found guilty of lying to city officials. Max Rodriguez has more. A city bill will be introduced at this week's Honolulu City Council meeting, proposing to deter people from making false statements to a public servant. You know, people are concerned that, well, if you lie to your council member, that could be a crime. That's not what we're talking about. This is for inspectors and investigators. Waters expects the proposed bill will go through drafts to narrow its language. Right now, it describes a city official as an employee who conducts investigations for compliance with any city ordinance or regulation. Waters says the bill was drafted with a specific department in mind. Where people are claiming that their house is smaller than it really is. They're doing that so they don't have to comply with the monster home laws. And we really just want to give DPP, Department of Permanent Planning, another tool to crack down on these. The city council chair says this proposed ordinance is really to empower city inspectors to make sure developers are following the city's building code, but says there could still be some challenges. Fact of the matter is, it's going to be really difficult to, to get someone um, convicted of this unless we get the cooperation of, as an example, the employee if they come forward. But my hope is that it's another deterrent. The ordinance proposes to penalize the false statements as a misdemeanor, punishable by up to a year in prison or a fine of $2,000. Max Rodriguez, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.